Ever since the debacle on Ryloth, the Empire has begun to experience skirmishes with the Mandalorians. Emperor Palpatine called a meeting with Imperial High Command. He informed them that the Mandalorians could be backed by the rebels and ordered the ISB to start an investigation. Darth Vader and Grand Moff Tarkin were tasked with ensuring order on worlds that the Mandalorians have attacked. Thrawn and the Seventh Fleet were assigned to ambush Mandalorian raiders in Imperial space. To do this, the Empire assigned Thrawn with his own Vengeance class Super Star Destroyer. Meanwhile, the Rebel Alliance were planning an attack on an Imperial installation. The Rebels set out and attacked the blockade orbiting the planet. The Rebels landed planetside and set out towards the Imperial base. The Rebel tanks opened fire on the base while the Rebels rushed inside. They engaged some death troopers who were guarding the city street. After entering the command centre, the Rebels came face to face with the Imperial commander. He was an ISP officer and he revealed that his spies informed him about the attack and he alerted the Imperial fleet. The rebels shot the officer and quickly rushed back to the transports. When they were back in space, they engaged the 7th fleet. Most of the larger ships panicked at the sight of Thrawn's flagship, but the smaller transports managed to jump away. Thrawn had no interest in needless deaths. The Emperor was pleased nonetheless, but his attention was now needed at a growing crisis on Coruscant. 